did. What's poppin' homies? This is your boy Frank Nitty back in the building. Once again, just left uh, the clearance store and now pulled up at the factory store, which is down the street. Still on International Drive. Apparently, this store do numbers as far as like all the stores in, I believe, Florida. This is probably one of the most highly trafficked stores, one of the highest grossing revenue stores it is. You would think that, or say to yourself, well, it must have a lot of heat because people just buy. Not necessarily the truth, right? It's because it's probably the highest grossing store or maybe in Central Florida or maybe in this area. That doesn't always mean that it has the heat. But I'm just curious to see what it is. I was like, oh, should I go here? Should I not? But... This is one of the consistent stores, man. You're always gonna find something in here. Um, may not be like like crazy, crazy heat, but it's maybe something that maybe you're after, something you've been hunting for a while, or something that possibly you're waiting to get um, on sale that you don't wanna pay retail for, or suggested retail. So this is a spot that you'll pull up and like, oh, okay, they got them here. All right, let me buy, let me buy a pair. So me and my son about to go inside, do our thing. I'm gonna do my thing. He's gonna act a clown as kids do. I'm, I'm over it already, bro. <laughs> you know, sometimes I had to turn this camera off just to get him in check. But anyways, man, enough talking. Let's go inside see what's popping, man. You ready, Carter? No. What you mean, no? We got to go. You ready? You supposed to say, yes, sir. You ready? Put it on pause. Yo, I decided to take the back way. So we pulled up on the side, which is the side of the outlet, if y'all familiar, with Orlando. Yo, they actually cut the woods down, man. I talked about that in a few vlogs. I was pulling up. I used to be, that's Turnpike. When you go to Turnpike to go to the outlets, you gotta go through that toll booth right there. And before, it used to be a lot of bushery and trees, but they cut it down, man, because you can see the highway. Well, I'm not sure if you could. I mean, y'all see it? Anyways, man, back to the outlets. Sun's down. It's about eight. My son's running for no apparent reason other than, Daddy, I want you to catch me and put me in timeout. Cause I'm not listening. Here he go running again. Surprisingly, surprisingly enough, the outlet is not that really packed. There was a lot of parking available, which is opposite to the to the belief that being a holiday, July 4th, with all these sales going on, you think it'll be crazy. But it is a weekday, man. It is Wednesday, so I don't know if that have anything to do with it. All right, we pulling up. We pulling up. We pulling up. We almost there. We almost there. Had a little hike. Actually, this is probably the closest I've parked in a while, so it's really not that crazy. Let's go through the doors right here. Go through. I know, we're almost done. Then we'll go home. All right, we're going to start for the apparel, man. It's not a bad look. Not a bad look for these uh, ISPA joints matching this right here. Yo, whoever's in charge of uh, product placement, <laughs> not a bad fit. Not a bad fit. Watch out. Go out the way. I just want to take a look at these shirts. It's kind of thick, man. I saw this in the other outlet, but they was going. They had size large and a different color. Um, they're going for thirty-two, man. It's a real thick T-shirt. Pause. But I'm not a fan. Of just do it across the chest, man. You also got the shorts for thirty-four dollars, twenty-four ninety-nine rather. And son, don't touch that that mirror, man. Don't put your dirty paws on that mirror. I like these camouflage shorts. Twelve dollars for tees. If Nike Air Force One's hard pass for me. I did cop this sweater, man. <laughs> I don't think I got a chance to rock it all year other than my videos, man. Also cop these shorts as well. I did not know there was Air Force One shorts, bro. I got these pair, exact same color. But they got them here for, because I think I copped mine for like $14, man, at the clearance store. They got them here for 50. That's crazy, that's crazy. Oh, they got a different color, which I had never seen before. Same price, like a teal colorway. Hope that's showing up in the camera. These Air Max ones, rather. Air Max one with the fluorescent swoosh. Not bad. I actually like this sweater, too. I like that Nike on the chest. That's dope. What are you hitting for? $70? No, nah, that can't be right. I guess so, because I don't see no other pricing. Dope pants. So my son dropped the whole road. Now he got all them boys help him pick it up, man. Hey, help him, Carter. Bro, I've been talking about these shorts for the last week and a half, man. I found these at uh, for the, we about to go right in a bit. In a bit, found these in finish line, and also at the spot I went to earlier. Their retail is like 125, man. They got them here at the Nike spot for like 50 beans, bro. These are some heavy weighted shorts, bro. These are dope, man. I like them, but damn, 
Fifty dollars is still pricey, bro. Oh, and they got the red joint as well. Damn, tempting, bro. So tempted. Fifty beans for one twenty-five is not bad. Sometimes, the back. Sometimes you gotta teach your kids some life lessons, man. He dropped that whole row. How do you feel about dropping that rack and having those employees pick it up, man? You understand you, what you did was wrong? Homeboy dropped the whole entire rack of jackets, man. Of jackets. Lucky it didn't fall on him. He didn't get hurt. No one got hurt, man. <laughs> but like four or five employees helping us pick it up, man. But anyways, a little bit embarrassed right now. Let's make it. Let's go and look at some shoes, man. Okay, these LeBron colorways are dope. It is 80 with 30% off, not a bad price. And this shoe is actually light as hell. Size 11 and a half, 12 and 10 and a half, man. And 11, I see. Bro, have you guys ever heard of Mama Focus? At least the new generic Mama Mentalities, Mama Raised joints. They're going for 70, bro. I don't know what tech is in here, nor am I willing to try them on, man. But this is a good price, but there's no additional discounts, man. The Laker colorway. I think we saw this in the last outlet, $99. Hard pass on those. <laughs> Hard pass on these ca uh, Canvas Air Force One Lows, Retro QS, CNVS, just means canvas, that's all. $80 if you do care for them. Bro, you got this uh, snake print joint, Foam Posit Pro Cup, 180 is the price. Kind of hefty, but it is a Foam Posit Cup though, so it makes sense. Okay, okay, now this is more like it, man. You can get this for $65 with 30% off, man. Size 11 and a half, 11, 10 and a half. 11 and a half is the biggest size I see, man. Price is all right. What in the world, bro? <laughs> okay, now this is a good price to grab them, man. It's $80 with 30% off. This to me is the best colorway of all three. The gray joint, the white joint, and all black joint. I do have this. I actually hooped in it the other day. Um, yo, not a bad price. Size 10, nine and a half, 10 and a half, 10 and a half. I don't see my size, but it's no biggie. Cause I, um, I got me a pair. Um, I hope a few people get a pair. Yeah, this is dope. Then you got the gray and, and black joints. $100 dope. Ironically, that's cheaper than these. And I think that's the best colorway of all of them, bro. I mean, you can't go wrong with this either, though, man. I like that colorway. We saw this in the Nike clearance store in the last pre previous video um, for 79 with 30 off, man. So that's a lot better. I believe it was that color. And this is the other colorway, which is probably my second go-to colorway. $99, no additional discount. Multiple sizes. However, I don't see size 12 though, but nevertheless. ISPA joints, $99. I wish the price was a little cheaper. I got mine a little bit cheaper than this. Um, it's probably one of the best colorways other than the all black joint. And you got the 87 joint, which is 109 hard pass. Ah, this is the 87. Ah. Don't remember this colorway, man, but this is a good price. I thought it was at 55, but now it's a great price. Fundamental difference is um, the 87 see-through where the 55 or Element 55 is actually a solid color, but I haven't seen this color, not in person at least. 109 is not a bad price. Multiple sizes, size 12. They are very, very comfortable. This is the 55. This is the 55. $70 if you want them. Yeah, I'm not flexing when I tell you I saw these for $19 at the clearance store. We are after we leave here. For $19, man. They got them for $64 with $30 off, man. Multiple sizes. Okay, okay. What they got here? I'm about to take a look at these. We got the Superman. Oh, shit. Superman LeBrons. What size are these? These are 11s. They're 11s? All right, what's it going for? 200 for these? All right. Oh, it's 30% off. Oh, it's 30% off of this? Okay, cool, cool. Y'all hear it. 200 for these with 30% off. Pass on that. What's in this box? Our pass on that. <laughs> yeah. What's in this box? Okay, the Lexi 3. Our pass on that. And we got the ones. What's in here? Ah. Oh, our pass on these. Huh? Yeah, yeah, this is a hard pass. Yeah, yeah, I'm just I'm vlogging at the same time. Alright. These are 109. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Falling on the budgets, the, the channel. Balling, up, balling on the budget? Balling on my, the budget? Yeah, I do like outlet videos and whatnot. Yeah. 109 for these, 30% off. Now, this is not bad, though. This is not bad. I like this. I like this. Yeah, I'm only going to put some stuff that's worth putting on here as far as like deals, like this one. $60 with 30% off. Not bad on. Not bad for that. Oh, that's even a better price. It's even a better price. 44 with 30% off, man. I remember I tried these on an outlet when I was doing on try ons like every visit. Uh, this is one of the shoes I tried on. 
Um, I think it could be pulled off if you got the right fit or if you got smaller feet. But I had a size 12, so it's a little kind of bulky on me. But at 44 with 30 off, not a bad price, bro. It's kind of dope. Multiple sizes, size 11, size 10, size 11, 11. Oh, I see a few 12s down there. Not bad, man. If y'all want to pull up and grab them, I already know what the comments going to be. Going to be saying, Frank, can you grab me a pair? They actually got two rows of them, man. Of the vault. Air Force 270 utility joints, both 30% off, man. Multiple sizes, bro. Multiple sizes. Okay, they got the black joint for the same price? Nah, I haven't seen this colorway. And maybe I have, but same price, $44 with 30% off. Not bad, man. Not bad for the price. We saw that earlier. 70 for that. What's wrong? Okay, we'll go after this. Some reflector 95s. We got the hybrid joints right here, the 91s. Well, not the 91s, but the 90 slash ones. Four slash. <laughs> the 94 slash ones. Hard pass on these joints. Pass. Pass. All right, these dope. I like these Tinkers. Uh, Air Max Plus OGs, 119. I like those. I like those. Not so much this colorway. Hard pass on that for 109. I mean, that's horrible at that price. Multiple sizes, too. What in the world, man? The Legacy, they cannot get rid of these. And they got pick of the week. I wonder if the pick of the week is what people pick or that's what the employees pick or that's what the manager feel should be the pick. Because I'm not see how these are moving. I'm not see who's buying them. I don't know, man. Y'all let me know. Y'all own any pairs of these? Now, I ain't going to flex, man. I do have one pair, which is the Lowe's, which I think is probably the better uh, silhouette, in my opinion, of the three one, the three, the three one twos. But that's just me. Yo, they still got the slippers here for 60. I like this joint right here. I like this, man. It's also the Pride Pack, or B True Pack, I believe. They're going for 100? Yeah. They got multiple sizes here, too. Size 11, 11. And these are the Tailwinds 98 B True, size 12, and they got my size. I think the colorway is dope, man. I like the silhouette, everything about it. Um, just not the price. And then you got the 720, the biggest ear unit, ear bubble unit in the game. Uh, with the B True colorways. You like that, too? I like it. And they got my size. They got everybody's sizes, I bet. They went 190 for it, though. I like these 98s, but 98 is my favorite. Well, one of my favorite Air Max. Hope that's showing up a lot better. See, I ain't the only one dropping boxes, bro. Homeboy just dropped a <laughs> whole bunch of boxes. Okay. 98 joints, 109 if y'all ladies care for them. Man, I don't know what's going on, man. For the last couple of videos, my audio just been out. So I'm going to voice over a lot of things. I saw those 98s. My son's struggling with me. I had to get it out of his hands, pry it out of his hands to show you guys those 97. We in the women's section, or I believe youth. I like these. These are the Wild West 97s. These are dope. I like the colorway. And this look like the reflective pack. Yup, definitely with the orange. See how small they are? So they gotta be women or youth. Can't remember, man, but those 97s are dope. 104 is not a bad price. Moving along. All right, so we in the Jordan section. Let me change my ISO a little bit person walked past me $75 for those are chlorophyll uh, threes I do have them cop miles for a dope price cop miles for roughly now nah, I don't think I got them that cheap man but these are these are kid sizes man I forgot oh we bought my son a little a pair of shoes some Air Force ones that's what my that's what Carter was holding in his hand I peep those Air Max ones bro those are dope those are dope all right so look at this Cortez bro for $90 not a bad shoe um, just don't like the price but these are dope as well what else all right moving on Yo, these are Black Cortez for $44. Not a bad price for these women's, man. Um, let me change the ISO a little bit, obviously. Not a bad price. These look like some gray joints. Excuse me. I'm record I'm editing on my MacBook Pro, so I can't really tell the colors of some of these shoes, but these prices are dope. 30% off of that previous uh Cortez and these for $39. Women, not bad. And you also got this pink joint. Again, I can't tell due to fact i'm looking at this in post man i can't i can't read. i didn't know what i said during the original voiceover but those are dope oh wow these these technos man hard pass even for 50 dollars with 30 percent off i don't know maybe some women out there that may want that i see the vibe they're trying to go for try to give that luxury look but nah they can't pull it off man 80 plus 30 off for that hard pass maybe some women out there can't pull that off man but for fellas i don't think we're rocking with those uh technos man let's keep it moving all right, just pull up on some 95s. These, again, all women. Uh, 109 for the, is the price. Uh, clearance store. 
No, it's not. That's no, not a clearance store. <laughs> I apologize, man. Yo, Jordan 11 in the building, man. Y'all remember when these came out? I wasn't a fan. A lot of people wasn't a fan. This was a GS shoe, youth shoe, women's shoe. I didn't pull the trigger. Uh, that shoe don't appease me at all. But if you want them, they're 130. And I've been seeing them at multiple outlets, bro. I, I think we're just, yep, we're in Shoe Palace, bro. We are in Shoe Palace. And I found the um, the Air Max 270s. These are supposed to be Odeb, Odell Beckham shoes. They're kind of dope, man. I actually want them. They only had a size 9. I had them call the other um, store, which is in the Florida Mall. Because this is it's a Shoe Palace inside the um, outlet on Violin. So that's where they had these. So they get general releases they also get limited releases they also drop them day of only difference is they're still retail price still retail gang but to find shoes like this that's recently dropped just pulled to an outlet and you can cop those that's kind of dope nevertheless sad story they called over they didn't have my size so i do not have these shoes but i think it's a dope execution of the 270 more shoes similar do more shoes similar to my this bad. style and the way um, they execute this, or even throw some collab, throw some other people, throw, throw some other NFL players that they have to, a couple B ball players, like they did the Air Max 1 and the Air Max 97, man. We won't be mad at you, Nike. Let's kind of change it up a little bit, all right? Now we're going to move on past this. I don't know what my son doing in the background. I don't know what he's throwing at the wall. Oh, yeah, look at these here, Jordan 1 Miz, bro. Now, this shoe is not that bad. Execution is kind of dope. I think it's that salmon looking color. People may call it pink. With a little um, wool or gold woolen swoosh and Air Jordan wing logo. Not a bad shoe. The leather on there, it's not to, up to par, but what Air Jordan 1 mid leather is, right? Unless they start giving us tumble leather on the Air Jordan 1 mid, then it'll change the game. But for right now, it's a hard pass for me. But I, I'm not mad at the shoe. And there's a few other shoes. Look at the Tinkers there. The Jordan 1 Lowe's, Chicago's, I got those. Or Black Toes, rather. Got those. I've been rocking my eyes. Love them. Uh, the Reflective Pack. Um... I think that's what's going to reflect the fact. And that guy. My son, my middle son. Carter, what up? Anyways, man, that's the end of this video. And that concludes my Nike outlet shopping with my son. If you like these type of videos, pull up, man. Hit that subscribe button, that notification bell, so you know when I drop videos like this. Everyone else, keep leaving your comments down below. And your boy get back to you as soon as possible. Until then, until we meet again, you already know my slogan. Good to go.